Right, moment of truth. Will we be able to use the contract stuff? Or has it, will it let me or not? That is the question, right. That's what we'll do. We're going to send the little tractor up to the store because we do need to buy the front loader and things like that. So let's send that up first. I always choose the wrong screen. Yeah. Up to the store. Right. Oh, seriously? Why? Why is that unreachable? See, oh yeah, it may be there's too many objects around it. Even though it would take a very poor driver not to be able to pick his way through that. Yeah, it could well be that. Alright, let's try that again. See if it is pathfinding or whether it is just. Okay. Let's try the edge of the... Okay. Let's try the edge of the field. Oh, does like the shop front. Okay, interesting. Right, let's shift the stuff off the uh, field as well. Yeah, because we are going to need to plant this so we'll get everything. What on earth are you doing going down that way? Do you know, seriously. Right, yeah, I do love this field. It's got a massive skirt. Yeah, it's going to serve us very well for the placeables in there. Why? Oh, I'm out. Yeah, it's weird how the angles look right. They totally look right. Now, how, how could I get that in that place and then all of a sudden I can't? <laughs> no, seriously. Oh. Right. Yes, we have work to do. I'm going to put this to the back because, yeah, we've still got a lot of... There is a lot of room. says as he jumps on the train track again. Right, where are oh, the yams we're going to have to use? Now, will it let you use things for moving objects, or will it say it's... I've never tried to do this ever, but obviously I'm just trying to shift things off our field. I don't know whether it will even let you hook up or... I've never ever tried this in all my years of farming simulator. I would have thought it minded. We're not trying to use the tractor, but it depends on how it's programmed. No, there you go. No, it's not that cruel. Smashing. I do like our equipment. We'd not have to do well. Right. To be shifting that off. I think we've got some of our bales, but we will sort that out. Definitely. Yeah, so chuffed, so absolutely blown away by how well we did yesterday on that contract. Really did not expect that. That should truly set us up. Yeah, it really should be a fantastic... Right, let's scoot this across. What we do is send a worker across... Yes. If we can nudge those bales off the side of the field. We'll send this up to the field so we can start to grab some of the other and we'll go up to the shop while this is driving over. Ooh, no, not, oh, no, it don't matter. I need to knock them over anyway. Let's do a ram. Physics. Yeah, physics indeed. Excellent. Right. Let's move this onto the side of the road and we shall send it up to the field. I'm not sure. They're always funny about railroads in almost all maps, even on all better on. It used to hate crossing the railroads, it did on the old stream farm. So let's cross the railroad and see if it's okay. We're also going to get out, because I always find they don't like you in the tractors. Ah, Betty. Let's cancel the job in case she does the round and round trick, which she is actually doing. Cancel. And we are going to send you to on the field about there. Yep, yeah, it's fine with me not being in there. Right, so we're going to grab that now. Go over to the shop. Buy a bigger weight. 
by the front loader, the Bandaranzi, and we're going to get that. I think we're going to go for the Universal Bucket. Now, tell you for why it's not. It is because it's 2,000 litres. The pallet box is 2,000 litres. So without any kind of faffing around, I know you could do a big one and it would still only fill 2,000 litres, but it just saves all that faffing around, to be honest. So we need to be buying. Ooh, we need to go inside the shop. Excellent. Oh wow. Was one here all along. Say there's gotta be one in the shop. That's right. Oh, look at that attention to detail. Absolutely love this. It's fantastic. Oh, there is another one. Okay, there you go. Smashing. There you go. I didn't expect a second one. That is definitely true. Right. So this. <laughs> right, we are looking for a front loader. Joking apart. Right, we want the new Bandarante. Oh, that is such good value. I think it's not got the quite the same range as a bigger one. That is the point. Can I afford. Yeah, it's got quite a limited range. I think in comparison to the quick. I think we want a smaller one though. Oh, it is so much. Do you know for what we need it for? Yeah, the the band around it. The minute we've just not got the money, that will do nicely. Oh, I'd forgotten. I'd say it down there. Do you know? Seriously, my I need it down there anyway. So, yeah, I'm being silly. Right. So we need. Yeah, we need a weight. And we're going to go for my, yeah, my absolute favourite, to be honest. We are, yeah, we've got that other one. I think this actually fits on top of it. I do love the self-made way. It's not only reasonable, but it is also fantastic. We'll go for Max. Main colour will go black. No, I think main colour will go red. And design colour will go black. Yeah, that's better. And we'll buy that for $900. 2,100 kilograms. I even like the look of it if I'm honest. Right, now we need a front loader tool. We're going to go for the self made that's got spikes and a bucket. There are some decent mods that I love that shovel up to 3 3.1 tons, but yeah. It's again, we've got to be careful. It's still two grand for what we want, but. It is, no oh, sorry, it's 1,200, it's so reasonable. We'll stick to black. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that. Right, smash it. So, let's grab that little lock and stick it all on. But yeah, this is... Right, oh, of course, yeah, that's down there and we're up here. <laughs> I've forgotten. Uh, oh well, at least we can take the milk stroke water thing and we can grab this. Oh, we've got to come specially to this shop now because that mistake. Ah. Or, we could use that feature that I don't normally use. We could, actually, that is true. We could actually use the reset. I do hate doing this, but yeah, this is a... Right, reset. Yep. Yeah, you saw me do it. I did. I admit it for once. Yeah. I don't want to waste time, if I'm honest. It's not fair to invite guests in and then to faff around driving. We've not got time to waste, but I still do hate doing it, if I'm honest. Really not a key. Right, so we need to set our... Yeah, we need to go and grab the other tractor as well. What we're going to do is we're going to go up. We're going to get one load of... Um, yeah, we'll drive this down, though. Let's grab that. Go down to our field and we shall Yeah, we should grab the two two tons and we should grab one set of bales and then we should follow down with our tractor using follow me back to our thing and then we shall set our tractor going whilst we go and get the rest of the bales. That is the plan. So yes. We'll just literally in fact yeah we could actually drive this and send it down onto the field. I'm sure we can manage this. Sure. Let's have a go anyway. Right, set destination, edge of our field. Please tell me, and we are going to jump into you. Oh, yeah, that's smashing. Right, 
one set and then we should get yes. but yeah this is the we ought to be leaving this set to last it's the, wow there are so many sad it's going to probably take most of this session to actually get this that's why I want to set the track to go in with the seed in the wheat oh God, it's next month isn't it it's not this month yeah it is I can't do it till September so this year we can't so there is no rush for doing that actually funny enough in that case I am going to literally do this as a time lapse because otherwise it's going to be terribly boring I can't chat for that long yeah, I'll chat afterwards. So I'm going to say my words. We're going to get all of these cleared and state taken to our land. Then we're going to stick our little mini BGA and everything in. And yeah, we'll have another chat about plans. I was quite pleased with my plans in editing. I thought that is spot on what I've decided. I was quite pleased. Yeah, I love having these discussions with you. It's uh, yeah, always dis yeah. It's I use you guys and girls as the sounding board even though you don't talk very much to me you do yeah you do leave comments now which is nice i do love that so as i've said so many times i consider this our farm not just mine why am i going back up the field i've just said i don't want to do that yeah anyway yeah we should chat after the time lapse i am going to say my words i'm going to see you guys and girls on the other side Actually, I have just thought of something that I did mean to do. Yeah, I, there's one thing I wanted that was a little bit intriguing to me was when we down this end, there was a ladder that went onto the roof over there that leads to the oil pumping thing. Now that's got to be for a reason. There's got to be something in that oil pumping field. So we're going to quickly do that in a minute. We're just going to fill these 14. And then what we'll do is we're going to pop over there whilst I'm chatting and then we'll go to the time lapse. Yeah. I did, uh, did quite well on that, grabbing those collectibles. Yeah, and they're not, it's not for the money anymore, because I think actually we've got it cleared. It literally is that one intrigued me. I'm not really going to be hunting for these anymore now. Yeah, I'm just going to show that. But this one here, with that ladder that left, led over to the pumping, oil pumping station that even existed on the other one at the back. Yeah, that intrigued me. So, let's not block the road. Switch the engine off a minute. Yeah, I mean, it does up there as well. There's obviously something up there that I cannot for the life of me see. But the one that intrigues me is this one. Because this only leads to that oil pumping station, so there's got to be something there. Looks weird in third person. Yeah, in fact, let's just go normal just for this, because it does look weird when you climb the ladders. Right, okay. I'm not sure if we can get back. He says, <laughs> he says, so, so assured of himself. Oh, have I led us on a wild goose chase? That is the question. Although it is very interesting, so it's not, yeah, it's not what he's, he's I'm sure it's going to be something. Either that or it is what's the call of lead herring. Oh, I can easily escape though, that is true. This leads to the field, field 19 actually, so we can have a bit of a look. Well, so far, I would corroborate my thing that there is something here. Think I was totally <laughs> Which is not the first time. I've ever, there we go, this is the field we're going to buy first. It did, yeah. It's got, you can actually extend the edge of this. I did used to do that before. Right, I'm going to, for well, once, I'm going to tab. Yeah. Ooh. Right. Let's take these two back to the field. Right, I am going to go into a time lapse because I was, as usual, totally wrong and there's absolutely nothing, or I missed it. So, yeah, I'm going to say my words again this time going to be until we clear this uh, field which is actually there's not as many as I thought 
So I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
Right, that is that. Yes, we should take these back. We shall unpack the... Yeah, I've tried... I think they go to the bottom, which, yeah, we should unwrap all of the silage. In fact, yeah, actually it makes sense to keep these in here for our first load into the uh, biogas, and then we'll just pick the grass hoards up again and stick those in the overtime, and then we'll grab the other set of um, silage ones before we do... Oh, we can't. Yeah, we're going to have to shift them ourselves, think about it. Oh, I had forgotten. We need the money from the contract, so we'll be releasing the contract as soon as we've done this, as soon as we get down to the bottom. I've loved, I thoroughly enjoyed using the JCB, I love this tractor, amazing. I've had this on a couple of new the Let's Plays, it's a beautiful tractor, it really is. Right. So then to cash these in. Boy did we do well. Look at that. 14, 28, 56, 66, 76, 84 and 94, 98. Oh and these 98 and 8. 106 bales. Boy is that amazing. Yeah I didn't realise some of this land isn't ours at the very back. That's a first couple of metres skirt. It's, yeah it's not ours. Right, so we're going to have to shift these the good old fashioned way with our spikes. So it's a good job we did buy them. We might need to move the lorries or we shall see where we're going to put the BGR. I would say the lorry is probably the best place. In which case we'll probably put these in the wrong total wrong place. We may have to put them. Yeah, true, we could go down that end. Yeah. Let's just shift that. Yeah, shift these bits of bobs out of the way a little. Because I would say. That's probably the best place for the BGA. A bit close to our house, I would say. So I'm shifting all of these out of the way. Right, let's grab the fertilizer spreader. Ooh, I thought it was the wrong side then, I'm not. Let's stick that. There, move the multi, and then we should release that contract. Attach all and also there's going to be some fertilizer that's in the way. Yeah, it doesn't like loose products, so we'll just quickly grab that in the bucket. I'll stick this over this side. And we will cash in the contract. Finally. Fantastic. 89,911. Right, let's just quickly get that loose out of the way and push that pallet out of the way. Oh, actually, yeah, we don't need this. We need to. Yes. Fertilizer, which we don't want to be wasting, stick that in the bucket. Why oh, don't we just stick some seeds as well? Indeed. Not quite nearly gone over it. Ah, those seeds I can see there. Typical. Why is it you always manage to dump things in the place where you are going to do building work? Smashing, wow, it's all. Stick this in that. Facts, no. It's silly. Stick it into the. Uh, yeah, the fertilizer. The spread. Yes, we shall. We are going to place the, uh, the BGA. Get our business underway. Smashing, let's grab the seeds. Yeah, we need to speed up time, we'll put the BGA down, we shall stick in whatever we can. Right, let's grab those seeds. That's the last thing standing in our way. Is that it? Oh no, 
out. I still see. I still see some red. Right. Let's try that. No, it's still. Do you know I'm terrible at getting this square? My J, I'm doing it from above. That never helps. Unless, no, if it wasn't on their land. Can't quite be square. No, it just seems to be. Oh, okay. In that case, if it is slightly in the wrong place, what we'll do is we use a smoothing tool. It does really does allow you to do that. It's just. engine and let me get myself out of the way because I always manage to stick myself in the way of where I'm going to build a terror right so production yeah. I do love this mod it's absolutely amazing it's nearly always the thing that I actually when you're buying a spent in the BJ with refueling I don't get the Okay, I don't get the difference. Oh, then we're gonna, yeah, we probably will actually. Yeah, so we need to shift the uh, sprayer out of the way. Of course, it would be in the way. Of course. Oh, seriously, I just moved it. Yeah, I think we need to come this side. There's quite a lot of stuff that we've got to put down, so space is not. Yeah, we are going to run out of space quickly. So to get this as close as possible. Yeah. Quite pleased with how much space we've actually got here. I can't wait. Oh, I keep missing it. That's it. Right, now then. Over here. That's it, smashing. Over this side, this is home. Right, let's try that again. Looks better. Yes, right. Production mini BJ with refueling. Now, this is the bit where I always keep saying where well, you really do need to be able to see everything because it has a bit of a skirt at the back. I don't want to go over the railway. Wow, that is going to come forward quite a lot. Uh, I also don't want to go to that, is true. We've got to get into the uh, so I think. All things considered, we shall probably go about there. Now this is moving. Why is this moving? Right, let's have a look. That seems, apart from the fact it was moving, I just hope I haven't gone too close to the railway. Not bad at all. Very flat. Very flat. That's the flattest I've ever seen it. We've lost a bit of field. Yeah, let's just sort that out. There is a tiny tad of, uh, yeah. Soften. Just on this corner. Not too bad. Yeah, we've really li literally just lost the very skirt. I can cope with that. Got plenty of room to actually go past that, so yeah, I'm quite happy. Right, okay, so that is the first thing. We've got 34 grand left, so we can't do anything else. So we now need to shift. Ooh. Actually, we can do it. Wow, that's chuffed me. I can actually place the Omatana one as well. I think we can put that next to it, because that's wasted space there. So it is a production. And see if it can go. Ah. Uh, it's quite a bit of skirt off that one then. Wow, a hell of a lot of skirt. Can let you do it that way. No. 
Wow, I didn't realise that. It's got such a skirt on it. That's as close as we can get it. Okay. So make sure that's not... Is that going to get in the way? Not really. It's not going to get in the way of that. Let's just make sure... Yeah, I want to make sure at the back we haven't got... Probably best if we look at it from the back. Right, okay. I hope that's in the right place because I should have saved it. Do you know, I'm a terror for that. Right, smashing. Yeah. Actually, that's not bad. I think, if anything, it goes down slightly, but it is a little bit. Yeah, that's not going to affect that at all, or very little, so you can never get it perfect. Right, we are now going to shift the side, let's move this out of the way now, because typical, it wasn't in the way, now it is. Right, let's move this over to the other side of the field, out of the way. We'll grab the little tractor, and we're going to shift... Oh, is that strong? Oh, please don't tell me this... I bet the Terrasems. No, I'm sure it was 210 horsepower, so that should be okay. Right. I think we're going to go into a little bit of a time lapse again, because now we need to get rid of. Oh, that's true. It's that one. We've got two weights, haven't we, on the back? It's forgetting. Yeah, we've got the pass through three point link stroke, right. And then, yeah, that's right. We can stick that into the uh, palette as a touch. Smash it. Right. Spikes out. We're going to need you. Right, smash it. I am going to say my words. What we're going to do is we're going to grab all of the silage, stick that into there, and all of the grass, and stick that into there. So this is going to take a few minutes. So I am going to say my words, and we'll see you guys and girls on the other side.
first one. We shall have a look in a minute. We'll send this back. Yeah, wow, boy, was that close. I thought this is going to take me hours if I do it that way. And yeah, I don't regret it, but it is it's quite a lot of money for all. But it is, there's a lot of bales. It would have taken absolutely forever. It would. An entire session, I think. But yeah, this is. What we're going to do is we're going to speed this up to tea time. Something I found out a, a, yeah, a few episodes ago on. Uh, Oh, well, we've got quite a few um, let's plays with this BGA, so actually, yeah, but we will... Let's drop that. Send that back. Give the shop a ring and ask him to pick it up. And then we shall have a look to see what we've actually got. Yeah, what we've actually got. I think we've got an awful lot. Select return. Indeed we will. Alright, let's have a look in our... So then... 522 tons. That is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Silage, yeah, full 75 tons. Now then, yes, that is just going to sell. Sell and store. That is true. Right, smashing. We're going to speed up till tea time, till about 4 ish. Going 360. Yeah, I'm not, yeah. I think this will be a next session to be honest, I think we'll be just literally, because this has taken a while, this is going to be a session, it's, it's amazing something, you just, you think, yeah, yeah, we're just a snippet, oh, I must forget, you got to remind those, yeah, got to be a vehicle now as well, yeah, we have to go near them the vehicle to remind them that gravity does exist, you can't do it as a, as a person, it doesn't care. that one in it's not quite in the catchment. Right. Yeah, I want to get this as full as we possibly can. And then we'll sleep through till the morning. Ooh. Yeah. Smash it. Right. We shall rest till the morning now. Right, smash it. Majesty. Wow, they've done off. That cycles are amazing. That is 29 tons. We'll do that in the morning, that we will. Right, let's rest till the morning. We'll see if anything else dropped in the day. You never can say, oh wow. That's another thing I've seen on my Hobo's Hollow as well, the walk about mother bins. It's like having a mobile silo. We just haven't got anything big enough to actually move it. Right, let's sleep till morning. And yes, yeah, about time we move till nine. It is getting till the yeah, effort back end now. We will not speed time up though now. What we will do is the last bit of yeah, shifting the silage into Wow, phenomenal. Yeah, we'll shift the uh the silage. I'm trying to think, do we yeah, do we do a time lapse? 20? No, it's 3 and a bit, we can have a chatter. Yeah, definitely next session though, now we shall get this planted. Oh, it's raining later. Yeah, but we've got to get this silage into the uh, into the BGA. I would imagine we've got a goodly amount. Only can put 75 tons in, but we can put 75 tons in later. By tea time, we'll, yeah. We're just going to put this load in for now. Digest it, but save because it's actually better. You get more money towards the back end, and we're not in a rush rush. What am I doing? I'm wanting that. Right. 75 tons in the hopper is what we need. Smashing. Fantastic. So, almost four of these, to be honest. And by the time it's tea time, we should yeah, we'll get get the uh, planting seeding done next session. Back. Sure, I've never had this. Is it a Porsche or a tip? I think a tip. Yeah. Wow, high tip. Very high tip. Gordon Bennett. Yeah, not a massive fan of the high tips. 
when you're going inside the uh, things like the grain thing over the road it does become a little although it's not that bigger it's not a monster like one of the 50 tonnes that goes so high it's unbelievable yeah productive session 74 grand I'm trying to think what we need to get up to we've got digestate though that is another that's why another reason why I want to stick that till the back end we're going to feed this until we run out we've, we've got months worth of yeah that's three months worth of processing yeah, it does 120 cycles, 120 tons per month. So the, uh, the mountain silo. So that's three months worth of 120 tons to feed this. Almost a morning and an afternoon. So almost. Yeah, because it can take 75 tons by tea time. That'll nearly all be gone. And then if you put 75 tons in and sleep, it does 150 tons. So yeah, it's. I always only ever used to sleep just straight through to the next day which only processes 75 tonnes so yeah I have learned that you've got to work with your productions much better than that definitely so that's what I'm trying to do yeah it's amazing it is actually how you think you're going to achieve X amounts. I mean, I know we've got the master plan to work to, and it doesn't matter. You, the sessions take what they take, but it's amazing sometimes how you don't always take into consideration how long something's going to take. You think, oh yeah, I'll do that in 10 minutes, and then you think, uh, not really. Try a few hours. I love the fact we've got that tanker. expect us to be able to have placed both that and that by this early on I'm quite chuffed that's a contract really has set us up really started the ball rolling I thought we'd be scratching in the dirt still by now but it's obviously a good set of circumstances it's yeah it was a monster I mean don't get me wrong we earned it it was a monster I mean, at the months, that is definitely the biggest contract I have ever done. Oh, oh hang on a minute. I'm trying to think, in, F in FS22, yeah, in FS19, ah, right, we are, we're finished. Right, let's fill this for tea time, we'll put 20 tons in. And then we should get connected red right up to the uh, Terrace M, the Pottinger. And next session, we shall start sowing our seeds. job is a good one. Yeah, I need to put the uh, toolbox mod down as well and the uh Ooh, that is a point. Oh no. That is where we're gonna leave it. Yeah, so we feel that again. Seventy four thousand six hundred and fifty one and next session well oh, that's right I was gonna do that. Yeah, I was going to hook everything up ready for next session. I think we'll just make the course as well. I do like to get ready for next session. We shall just get this plotted on course play. If I haven't already. I don't think I have that. going smash in generator three headlands I think
Oh, that's a point. Field number five. Six meter. Smash it. And that really is how we're going to leave it. Definitely. So, ready to see. So, this particular month, we've got all of that put in. I can't wait till we've done this so we can cycle through the months to get all the way through. January, February is usually the best selling time for digestate. Let's have a look. Oh, it does it. I don't know that it shows you for digestate because it's technically not something that normally you sell. But uh, obviously with a slurry yard, which is what, ah, that's the point, I need to buy the slurry yard. Ah, of course it's not going to show the proper, that's interesting because this actually has, oh I'm selling silage, I'm not tr looking for silage, I'm looking for digestate. Yeah, January. Obviously, that is the other thing. I think we will place that now if we have got room. I think it'll be the only place we can stick this is over here. Do you know? We'll leave that to the next session. We will. But yes, I think the only place it can go is over here. I'm thinking about it. Can we grab that out of the way? Would be not useful. This little yard is massive. I think it's only just going to go in there. But that's a nice surprise because it does normally take a lot of your field up and that looks so yeah, I don't think I've ever had a uh, the edge of a field that's quite so uh, cool stick that on the car park just for a little while yes I'm looking forward to using this it's a long time since I've done well I don't know what I'm going to do yet actually because I think this likewise is in the way. I'm trying to think where we can stick this and we can stick that. Yeah, in the front of here. It. We may as well do it actually, to be honest. It's going to cost us whatever. Although, no, no, that is true. You never know what, to what you might need your money for at the beginning, definitely. We just we could need a tool that we've forgotten or anything, so we won't do that. Oh, that's a point. I've not looked at my favourite point. Yes, I have. A Santana. That's a good price. But yeah, I know what I'd buy if I was going to. Wow. Nope. Yeah, no, I'd get the Roberts if I was going to do it. I know it's not a... Right. That is definitely where I am going to leave it. I am going to say thank you very much for watching. Hope you're going to continue with me on this. Ah, we have made very rapid progress. Yeah, we have an awful lot of tonnage of grass that's going to be converted into silage all the way over the winter. We have got our BGA ready, churning and doing very well on our energy business got us up to 74,000 and yeah that's full ready to process again so yeah we will be able to feed this all the way through the winter and I should imagine we should I reckon definitely be able to afford field 19 of course we have got to buy the slurry yard which is another 50 grand but I still think we'll do it just about we should see I might be wrong anyway without any further ado I am going to say goodbye for now <laughs>